everybody. Happy Monday. Happy November 2nd. I was unable to do this video yesterday, so I'm going to make it today and that's okay. I'm super excited to bring to you the brand new Close to My Heart catalog for November and December. So I'm going to show you some of the really awesome products that we have going on and some of the specials as well as the stamp of the month. It is super cute, so I can't wait to show you. So without further ado, yay! We are getting into Christmas. Now, for the October, I'm sorry, for the September and October catalog, we had a lot of the fall themed stuff, but um, there are a few things in here that you could conceivably use for the cards that you're still making for Thanksgiving and birthdays and all of that um, with a fall feel, but right now we're heading into Christmas. And if any of you have ever worked retail, you know that Christmas comes out in October usually, so. With that being said, I can't wait to show you some of these things because they are so much fun. There's some really cute things, some pretty things, so many ideas that you can just take and run with and make your own. So real quick, let's check this out. So the very first um, couple pages that we've got in the catalog, um, they're going to share with you the Craft with Heart scrapbooking and card making kits which you can find on the website that goes into detail it's a little um subscription that you pay for <clears throat> and get you can get monthly you can get quarterly or you can get every 12 months um it's pretty awesome so you get everything you need to make scrapbooking kits there are some really really cute ideas and papers and then you also can have the opportunity to sign up for the Craft with Heart card making. And it sends you everything you need to make the cards. Really cool. You can check that out on my website. It's called Craft with Heart. Very cool. Okay. Check this out. Jingle Joy. Brand new Christmas line for this year. The colors are super fun. Super cute. They look really, really good because... There are some retro prints in here. What? Really cute. Look at that Santa Claus. Isn't that cute? The papers are really fun. There's flamingo pink, raspberry pink, clover green, evergreen, black pebble, white daisy. All of those colors are used in these layouts and products. So the first item is the Jingle Joy paper packet and sticker sheet. Or you can just get the paper packet without the sticker sheet. But it's so cute. You're going to want the sticker sheet. So, look at this paper. How fun is that? There's different patterns. You've got hearts. You've got trees. These really cute little um, Christmas lights. You've got your plaid gingham sort of looking pattern. You've got black and gray polka dots. As well as this really cute... Um, Stamp, I'm sorry, striped pattern. Very fun. I like the colors in that. And then up here is the sticker sheet. Look how cute those stickers are. Merry Christmas, holiday happiness. You've got your reindeers, your stockings, your, you know, traditional sort of Christmas images. <clears throat> we also have the Jingle Joy coordinating cardstock. Now, the cardstock you definitely want to get if you get the paper pack because these are all the colors that are featured in the pattern papers, but the solid colors look really good as your backgrounds, your photo mats. Um, you can stamp on these to get different images with your stamps. Um, there's so many different things you can do. Um, these are die cuts that you can use for your layouts. I like how they're in black this year. That's going to look really fun on some cards. Really like that. And then down here, you've got your Picture My Life cards, which again, um, as I've talked to, to you about these cards before, they come in four by six or around three and a half by five. And you can use them for mats. You can use them for images on cards. And each card comes with an image on the front and on the back. And one image might be vertical. The one on the other side could be horizontal. You never know what you're going to get until you get the pack. But I guarantee you're going to love this. There's so many cute things. Christmas trees, Santa Claus. Oh, and...
and journaling squares. So these have little lines on it that you could write your little story or write what's happening in your pictures or just even put it on the inside of a card and write your sentiment on it to give your card an extra pop. Super cute. Um, the stamps are really cute. Oh my gosh. Look. How cute is that? Look at this retro Santa. That is super, super cute. You've got your reindeer, your sleigh. You've got a banner here that you can stamp your sentiments in. And these are the sentiments. And you've got a circle stamp. You've got a little present. And it's cool that they give you these types of little um, images as well as stars because you can use these to make different patterns on just a regular cardstock or a piece of paper and make repetitive patterns all over your, your piece that you're working on. You can use embossing ink and put embossing powder on them to make the images really pop, especially on this dark background. That's really neat how they did that. Um, here's some other stamps. This is called the Jingle Joy Scrapbooking Stamps, and these are more stamps. So there's Believe, Merry Christmas, there's a couple of trees. I really like these bells. These would look super cute, um, embossed, I believe, with different colors. You can use whites. I mean, that would look really cool with metallic embossing. That would look cool. I like that bell, too. But the sentiments are always a big hit. I like those. Okie dokie, moving on. We've got the Jingle Joy Scrapbooking Workshop. As you know, if you purchase the bundle a little bit later on in the month, Close to My Heart will often do a scrapbooking workshop that you can watch and work along with on Facebook. But um, this gives you everything you need to participate in the workshops, or you don't even have to purchase um, participate in the workshops. You can just get it and go with how you want to make your pictures and cards. But that is really cute. As you can see, the different ways they use the pattern papers. Very fun. I like this one. Black background, different colors. They in integrated all the snowflake shapes from the die cut kits. You can also use um, thin cuts with your stamps to make different images on there. Pretty nice. I like this, very cool. Um, Jingle Joy also has a card making workshop kit, again, like the scrapbooking. If you purchase this kit, you can watch along with the video to learn how to make certain cards. And um, there's so many ideas on how to do this. You'll get your pattern paper, you'll get some coordinating card stock, you'll also get stamps with the thin cuts. And this one also comes with some stickles, which is awesome. I love stickles. Stickles is... Um, I'll just show you this one really quick. It's a little bottle of glitter and it's awesome. It's just like a, a glitter glue type thing. Uh, it dries really nice. Um, there's different colors that you can use, but this one comes with the silvery type. It also comes with 16 cards. So you're gonna get 16 white card bases and 16 envelopes so you can make all the cards that you like this would be really cool to do with a couple of girlfriends maybe come over hang out have a glass of wine make some cards you can also do this with your kids help them make a couple of cards that they'd like to send to grandma or maybe they want to send to their friends from school because they haven't seen their friends in a while i think that would be a really fun project for them to do so this is the kit now it comes with the stamps and the little die cuts. You will need a die cut machine to use the, um, the thin cuts, but if you don't have one, you can also just use the stamps by themselves and cut them out um, manually with your hands. And that's okay too. So these are what the stamps look like. You got a little presents with some bows, a couple of sentiments. How fun is that? And these are some of the ideas of what people came up with on how they made their cards. As you can see, they, they used the thin cuts in the stamp to cut out the presents. This card is used, um, was made using Distress Oxide inks. As you can see, they made a um, background using different colors of the inks to just make, it looks cute, I love that. This one, they used the black and white with the color, looks really clean. I like that a lot. Those are just a few ideas that you can use. 
The second product line that Close to My Heart came out with in this catalog is called Serenity. This is so pretty. It's a lot of blues and browns and golds. Very, very clean, very classy. There's patterned paper, there's sentiments, stickers, uh, looks like gold foil stickers. Yeah, that's it. It's very pretty. Um, the colors that are used in this line is Bluebell, Sapphire, French Vanilla, which is a very creamy, creamy white, it's very pretty, Toffee, and Espresso. Um, it also, there's a paper pack and it also comes with a sticker sheet. Again, you can just get the paper pack if you like, but the sticker sheet is fun. So here's the paper pack along with the sticker sheet. Very cute items. As you can see, there's the different florals and banners. Very fun. And then on this side, this shows you the items that go along with it. The Picture My Life cards. You've got, you also, oh, for those of you that have a Cricut machine, you can also go on and get Cricut images that you can cut out for your machine to use specifically for this line. It's really cool. Here is the coordinating card stock. This line is really unique because not only does it come with the one, two, three, four, five solid colored sheets, it also comes with a couple of glitter sheets as well. And the glitter sheets are in Bluebell. These little um, glitter gems are also in Bluebell. It's a very pretty bluish gray color. I like that a lot. Um, remember, each of the card stocks are dual sided. There's going to be a lighter side on one of the sides. So you're gonna get a dark and a light. Very pretty. So these are the stamps that come in this set. It doesn't come with the papers. You have to buy everything separately, but these are the coordinating ones. So you've got very pretty sentiments. This one comes with a wreath. And then there's the bows, the little sentiments you can put inside or you can put it on a tag outside of, however you like, but they're very pretty. This one shows how they did it by making the wreath and then they put the sentiment directly on the card. Very cute. These are some extra stamps. As you can see, you can build your letters how you wanna say, love you, there's opportunity to make joy, there's hope, good stuff. More stamps. There is also a Serenity scrapbooking workshop kit, which comes with everything you need to make a couple of really neat pages. Comes with um, your glitter gems, your memory protectors, some really pretty cardstock papers, as well as the coordinating cardstock. So that's what that is. Very pretty. On this side, it shows you a couple of other ideas that you can use the pretty paper with. I like this idea of the repetitive circle. And then they put patterned papers in that. That's really pretty. There's also a card making workshop using this kit. Everything you need to make 16 cards. You've got four each of four designs. I mean, you can make the cards however you like. This just gives you an idea. Again, you can tune in to the Facebook page to watch the live videos if you'd like to craft along or just watch to get some ideas. But these are the stamps, very pretty. There's a lot of florals. Here's your really pretty sentiments. Congratulations, wedding day, anniversary, and a cute little happy. And then there's the coordinating thin cuts, envelopes, and the cards, your pattern paper, and your cardstock. And here are some ideas that people created using this wonderful line. Isn't that pretty? I like the, the dark blues and the light blues. There's a lot of potential in that set. Very pretty. Okay, there's also a brand new mix-in kit this time around. This one has a lot of such pretty colors. Black, toffee, evergreen, sapphire, bluebell, and smoothie. So these are what you get. You've got some leaf patterns. You've got hearts. Here's looks like little trees. You've got more little trees, some like speckled dots, a really geometric pattern. You've got leaves, polka dots, stripes, 
snowflake geometric pattern and brown gingham. This is cute. I like that a lot. Okay, now into the fun stuff, these stamps. The gnomes have been a big hit in the last couple of catalogs. Um, we had the gnomes for like the uh, Halloween and now going into Christmas, you know we're gonna have some gnomes. Check out these guys, they are so cute. That little guy with the, the reindeer ears is hysterical. There's a lot of potential to use these guys. On your layouts or your Christmas cards, <laughs> there's no place like gnome. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, we've also got um, just more stamps. We've got the Jubilee Crew, which is more of a, a cutesy little animal and snowman type. How fun is that? They're wearing little sweaters. How cute. There's also, um, you've got your Beach Santa. You've got a Scandinavian pumpkin. Merry Christmas. Here's some more cute ideas that you can use all of these products and how to make things. You've got the um, Winter Friends Stamps and Thin Cuts. These are cute little animal friends and you can make their little scarves. Those would be cute on Christmas cards. You've got the Merry Borders. These are neat because you can use these stamps on your cards to make different patterns. That is very, very pretty. Alrighty, what else do we got? We've got um, a religious stamp this year, uh, the Nativity, it, uh, Tis the Season, this one. It's really pretty. We've got Noel. And then we've also got these sentiments. How cute is that? Um, this one is called Trust in the Lord, uh, Be Strong and Courageous, Peace and Joy. You don't necessarily have to be religious to use some of these stamps because they are so cute. It is a universal stamp. Very nice. I like those angel wings a lot. That's really pretty. But if you are the religious type, that will be perfect for you. We have Happy Hanukkah stamps for my Jewish friends. Check this out. Very cute. This would look really pretty with that Serenity kit with the blues and the golds. That would look nice. There's a joy set. Cheers. This would be perfect to make New Year's cards or you want to send an invitation. That would be really cute. That would look fun used embossed ink with like glitter or silver embossing powder. That would look so much fun on a dark background. We also have elegant snowflakes. These are so pretty. They also have um, thin cuts so you can get the stamps with or without the thin cuts. If you don't get the thin cuts you'll f have to cut them out by hand but the thin cuts are also shaped like the stamps so that you don't have to cut them by hand. But these are really cool because they're fairly large and there's opportunity to use these as um, a background pattern or you can use them as individual embellishments on a card say or you can also um, Stamp the image and emboss them with metallic paper. I'm sorry, metallic powder on your paper. These would look really cool on a dark card with like white embossing powder or silver. That would look so, so pretty. There's your sentiments. How fun. I'm gonna have to get my hands on that. I think that would make some really nice cards. We've got a really nice um, new baby. This one is called Little Welcome Little One. For those that are able to have children and can have children, that would be fun. Here's a bear hug. That would be neat to make uh, children's cards with. That is so cute. Sending you a big bear hug. That's nice. There's a stamp called One Friend, and that's nice. The sentiment says, one friend can change your whole life. That is awesome. I think more of our friends could use a reminder that they are really special in our lives. So that would be a nice sentiment for a card. There's a new birthday line. This is fun. On your birthday, these are all birthday sentiments. These can go inside your card. They can go as a sentiment on, on the outside of your card. They can be stamped repeatedly on the back of your card to make a background. They're really nice. 
Look at this. Why limit the fun to one day? Happy birthday month. We all have family and friends that have a birthday month, and it's it's a lot of fun. They just celebrate all month long, and it's it's awesome. I love that. We've got a new thinking of you stamp and a thank you stamp. These are very nice if you're just making quick thank you cards or thinking of you cards. Can never send too many of those to people, especially now as things are changing and going into the holidays. We all have a lot of friends and family who are isolated from others or just trying to stay safe and they've continued social distancing. So sending them a card with a little greeting goes a long way. It really does. So think about that. It'd be nice. Um, dragonfly. This is cute. Dragonfly stamp. We've also got these fun sentiments. Congratulatory words. Way to go. Congrats. Yippee. Those are fun. Those would be great for a kid. Maybe they did something awesome like they got an A on their, car, their uh, report card or they won one of the games or they just did something monumental and they deserve a little kudos. Those would be fun for the cards. We've got some more thin cuts. These are borders. Look how pretty that is. Looks like a sweater pattern. We've got houses. We've got berries. Merry Christmas. Christmas lights. And then this pattern here, which looks like a sweater. That would be fun to use with patterned paper. We get into the Melissa Esplin um, handwriting. If you like bl brush lettering, she's the, the way to go. She's a calligrapher and a lettering expert. So she's got a whole bunch of kits on here that you can learn how to make your print or your um, cursive and your lettering so much more elegant. There's a new story by Stacy. Um, she is known for writing some really good stories about her families and her life. She documents everything. So here's a little kit that you can use to document some of the things in your life. Write your stories, add some photos. Super easy way to come out with a, with a small scrapbook. We've got more albums. And the best part of November is the stamp of the month. Now, for the stamp of the month, if you spend $50, you can get the stamp of the month for $5. Alone, the stamp is $18.95. Or if you become a VIP with me, you can potentially get the stamp for free with your purchase of $50 or more. So this is the stamp kit. How cute is that? Super cute. You've got a coffee or a cocoa cup. You've got some cute sentiments. You warm my heart. Here's a cute coffee cup you can, you know, give to somebody like with tea, if they love tea or even cocoa, coffee. And then look at this pie. How cute. Pumpkin pie with the whipped cream. So, so fun. Wishing you a cozy holiday. So I'm going to take this out of the sleeve real quick to show you. I've shown you the stamps before, but they come in a little package. Look how crisp those are. Candy cane, a poinsettia fun but they all come with a backing as well as a foam back so that you can stamp your image to get a nice even distribution of ink but they're all super duper easy to use nice and acrylic you just take one of these bad boys put them on your acrylic block season it put your ink on it do whatever you like with it this is a really cool set, and I encourage you to grab it before it's gone because this one is adorable. This one could make some really fun winter cards, invitations. You could even use it as a Thanksgiving card with the pie. That would be fun, and the you warm my heart. Maybe you want to have a cocoa party, and you want to invite some people to come over and have a cocoa bar. That could be fun. So send them little cups and the you warm my heart. That could be a lot of fun. So... With that being said, that is all I have for you today. I'm sorry I've been a little MIA. Things have been a little busy as things are moving along through the year. 
Um, but just know that I am still happily crafting and I look forward to bringing you some more amazing products. So check out my website if you have any questions about some of the things that I've kind of cruised through this catalog with. Go to my website, check it out. Um, you'll find it under promotions and shop. You can see everything that you might like to get your hands on. And if you have any questions, just please message me or give me a shout, give me a call, and I will happily help you with whatever you need. So until then, happy crafting, and I can't wait to see what you come up with. And don't forget to sign up for my VIP club. It's so beneficial to you. You will get your discounts. You will get some amazing products. You get more opportunities to get your discounts, as well as your stamp of the month. It's a great program. So if you have any questions, again, give me a jingle. Have a wonderful day. Take care and stay safe. And remember to, to share love. Send cards to people. Don't be afraid. People enjoy getting those sort of things. Whatever you create, I'm so sure that your friends and family are going to appreciate and love you for it. Have a great day. Bye.